Hey everybody, it's the coach, and this is Madden 19 on EA Sports. Coming up, Pro Bowler Derek Carr and the Oakland Raiders take on the Red Rifle, Andy Dalton, and the Cincinnati Bengals. With that, let's get up to Paul Brown Stadium in Cincinnati. For the call, we bring in our broadcast team, Brandon Godden and Charles Davis. Coach, it's the NFL on EA Sports, and there you get a look at Paul Brown Stadium on the banks of the Ohio River in Cincinnati. The enthusiasm of this Cincinnati crowd in full effect a moment ago as their Bengals took the field to the delight of this sold-out crowd, and they're all set as they'll match up with Derek Carr and the Oakland Raiders. Hi again, everyone. I'm Brandon Gordon to my left, Charles Davis. And, Charles, you focus on this Bengal team entering play. It's late in the year. We all know it. We've seen the calendar for these guys. Their bodies could probably use a break, but they have to push on. And they're really not as worried about that as maybe we think. They know they've got the entire offseason to rest. All they care about is the game in front of them and finishing strong. It's the final three weeks of the season. Still plenty to play for here as we're underway in week 15. This is taken about seven yards deep. They go play action here on first down. And his guys will take over at the 25-yard line. Now after the INT, it's Carr. Throwing the out route incomplete. It's Nelson. Working from the gun, it's Carr. And Cook has it, left side. A Raiders first down. On first and goal, Washington. And he's in. Touchdown, Raiders. DeAndre Washington. He may be auditioning to try and stay with his own current team. I think he's auditioning for the rest of the league to try and find a spot. Today. This team is looking for a new quarterback. They'll run it now, out of the gun. And he's able to get out to the 32, brought down there. Lee! Lee! Now a play fake here on first down. It's incomplete. Took a shot, couldn't connect. Brandon LaFell, his intended target. That'll bring up second down. And a look now at the Cincinnati offense. Out wide, they have A.J. Green who can run every route you want on the route tree and take the top off of defense with his speed. Passing again. Dalton on second and ten. He's going to air it out deep for Green. And they went for a big play through the air on second down. Couldn't connect. Now it's third. A look at the defensive starters now for the Raiders. They were excellent a week ago in the win over Pittsburgh. And I'm eager to see the game plan and trying to attack them this week because when you take it away four times through interceptions. From the gun, Dalton looks to throw. And he fires one that's intercepted. Picked off by Marcus Gilchrist. And the Raiders are in for six. Touchdown. Only their second drive now run their offense, try and get back into the game that way, and then look for some help from their defense. Try to forget about that pick six last time out. The drive starts with a handoff to Bernard. And he'll get this one across the 20. Be ready to play. That's the mantra of every organization. The key is having guys on the roster who are capable of filling in and playing at a high level. That's when you know you've drafted well, scouted free agents well. Out of the gun, it's Dalton. And Eifert has it. Fakes the give to Bernard. Dalton. And it's incomplete. Took a shot, couldn't connect. Dalton gives to Bernard. And he is met at the line of scrimmage, and he goes down right there. Play action him or stick something to him between the second and the third level. 
Avoiding the tackle, Bernard. Finding his safety valve here. That's complete. When you scored points, it's a whole lot better view than when you're trying to figure out how to fix things there. On the ground, this is Jalen Richard. Get down, get down. On second down, here's Carr. Sliding out of the pocket. And past the 40. And that means he lost a timeout in that challenge. And as a coach, you hate that. Don't know if you took the advice of the player. You threw it yourself, but it didn't go your way. At the end of the day, it all comes back to the head coach. He has the final determination on whether to actually challenge the player or not. In this case, it didn't pay off for him. And that's got to be so heartbreaking. You throw that flag, you probably feel ripped. And he'll be taken down by the Bengal pressure. From the gun, it's Carr. And this is caught by Martavis Bryant. A good pick up there, a 22. They'll run it now, out of the gun. And just a short gain that time as they're able to get him down. They'll run it now, out of the gun. And he's going to get stopped up quickly. Throwing his car on third down. And there is Amari Cooper, his first catch. On first, here's Washington. And this play will be blown up. He'll lose yardage. Car to throw on second down. He's going to flip one out here to his running back. They fake the handoff. Now Carr. And he finds Cook. And he gets it all the way down inside the 10. They come out here in the eye. They'll try and run for it on first and goal. And he goes backwards on this one. Countered it with extra linebackers who brought a little bit of speed and heft and able to really make a big-time play for their defense. Now Carr throwing on second down. Rolling to his right. This time for Smith, and it's intercepted. A great read, and it's picked off. Also to the right and threw right into it for an interception. He'll start on the ground here with Bernard. And he'll lose yardage here. Back at the 11, he goes down. And a great example right there for the loss on the tackle. Here's Dalton. And he's got the hook up to Brandon LaFell. Dalton up play action. He's going to air one out. That's going to be knocked away and incomplete. They tried to throw for it there. Nice effort to knock that one away and bring up second down. They'll run it now out of the gun. And he'll be tackled at about the 35. They need just a yard here. It's third and one. Despite only needing one, Dalton to throw. Blitz coming and down he goes. Trying to shake off the interception from the last drive. He'll look to throw. Give him 13 yards on the opening play of the drive and also give him a first down. Carr gives to Richard. Breaks the tackle now with Allen. And able to get this one across the 45 before he's brought down. Carr now on first down. And complete right side to Cook. Carr going to throw. Throwing for his running back, and he's got him complete. They get 11 back on that one. It leads to third down. Shotgun now for Carr. Flush to his right. He can run for it, and he will. Four yards there as they let him out of the pocket, and he got enough for the first. On first down, Carr. He couldn't quite hold it. Got hit. They'll run it now out of the gun. So he got free of one tackle, but couldn't do a whole lot else. Now Carr. And this is going to be incomplete. The kick by Tavecchio is good. To throw here, Dalton. To the left side here for Eifert. 
Makes me glad I didn't make it in that league. I would have had a really difficult time. But now you get to sit up here with me. Yeah, and that's fun, isn't it? And what a really nice game right there on first down for them. Brings up a nice second down for them. Right back to him on first down. And he'll be brought down just shy of the 45. Dalton throwing on second down. And he finds Tyler Croft. First catch here before halftime, and it goes for a first down. Now Dalton with a first and ten. Pressure, and he's going to be taken down. Second down, Dalton. And on the left sideline, he caught it, but out of bounds. This will be a tough third and 18. Here's Bernard. And he got blown up. They go play action here on first down. Let's it go for Nelson. And it drops down incomplete. Get down, get down. Carr again here on second and ten. Bryant with a catch right side. A good pick up there, 26 yards. They'll run it now, out of the gun. And nowhere really to go there. Looking to throw on second down. Carr, and Nelson's got it here right side. Now a play fake here on first down. And he can't find anywhere to go with it. On play action, now Carr, flushed out right. On the crossing route, he hits his man, Amari Cooper. Carr looking to throw on third and two. And this is Clark. It's Cooper. And he is in. Touchdown, Raiders. And with time running short here, they'll simply take a knee, and that should do it for half number one. So we've reached halftime with the visiting Raiders out in front. As we'll send you down to Orlando, we check in with Jonathan Coachman for our EA Sports Halftime Report. Coach. Okay, Brandon, time for a sprint to the finish as it's time to get you caught up with what's happening around the NFL here in a pivotal Week 15. We'll get started out at Arrowhead Stadium in Kansas City where it was the visiting Chargers who were able to come in and steal one on the road. Phillip Rivers, two touchdown passes as his guys remain unbeaten. From there, we head east to Baltimore to check on the Ravens at home at MNT Bank Stadium. And they trail the visiting Buccaneers as that game has gone to the half. The rookie from USC, Ronald Jones, a touchdown run. Lastly, we're off to the Rocky Mountain, Denver, Colorado. See what's happening with the Broncos. And they were losers in that ball game to the visiting Cleveland Browns. Jarvis Landry, a touchdown catch in the victory. And our game has been the play of Derek Carr. Coach, thank you, and we welcome everyone back for quarter number three. Here's a give to Rashard, and he'll get this one up to the 26. On second down, here's Carr. The Bengal pressure gets him that time. Down he goes. On third and long, it's Carr. They'll roll him out right. He's going to run, but he's got a long way to go. He opted to go with a scramble, gets two yards, and now it's fourth. I think we can go inside the locker room, all right? <laughs> and I think we would see up on the grease boards, stop them defensively, get the ball back for the offense, and let's go downfield and score. Seems simple, right? The last part, we have to find out that's going to happen. But the first part worked to perfection. The reason that counter or misdirection plays work so well is that usually you've given them a reason to think that everything's going to the direction that starts initially. You've run that type of a play throughout the game. You've given them that look. Fakes the give to Bernard. Dalton. And the grab by Croft. Third down. A shot here for Dalton. And he's taken down. Trying to do a little too much, getting outside of the pocket, and it results in a sack. His pride to say, okay, I don't care how many you throw in my direction, 
I'm still going to find a way to get open. I will use different moves. I will move against formation. I will come underneath routes and try and run through some people. And Looking for Cooper, and it's intercepted. And the best part is that they made their own break. Taking the ball away. Now they just look at their offense and saying, guys, let's go. Come on, capitalize on this one. Ball start, offense. They'll run it now, out of the gun. And they'll go backwards here. Play action here with Dalton. And he's going to be intercepted a third time. Picked by Daryl Worley. Now a hand off to Rashard. And an alley to run. He's got daylight. He's at the 50. The 30. Past the 20. And all the way in. Touchdown, Oakland. They may have to change things offensively to try and settle things down, not just for the guy throwing the ball, but for the rest of the offensive unit because there's confidence has to be shaken a little bit. And you just wonder, is the backup going to start to warm up a little bit? Now we've got that artificial surface. You see the pellets go up. Still a nice play by the defense. And they will stop him after a fairly minimal pickup. How about the inside linebacker, though? His job on this play, shadow the quarterback and hold him to a short gain. Did it to perfection. And that's complete to LaFell. You're around that long at that position, you're doing something right. Just remember this, when he was young, he thought the crafty veteran was simply a guy who couldn't run anymore. Now he understands a little bit better. And the play goes nowhere. Well, that was a simple throw and catch, but even with that completion, zero yards gained, so they're behind schedule on down and distance. I think they were hoping to get it to him. He can make a man or two miss, but that window closed quickly. To run the football in that situation, I think that goes back to their practice and game planning. They've seen things that they've seen on tape and in previous games that led them to believe that even in a long distance situation. Now he's hit, and Dalton lost the football. And the Raiders pick it up, and his guys will take over. Now a first down carry, it's Hill. And he will lose yardage here to the 31-yard line. On second down, Hill. And able to push his way forward here for a good little gain. Now, we're waiting. 7.34. Throwing his car on third down, eluding the pressure right. Toward the sideline, did he keep the feet in? Yes, he got a boat down. To throw his car, he'll buy some time right. Caught on the slant. And he'll take it into the end zone for a Raider touchdown. Big word. I like it, though, yeah. because you're exactly you right. Like that, don't you? All game long, they've struggled moving the ball. Now whistles and a flag, and I believe a bangle got going a little early there. Ball start, offense. They'll run it now, out of the gun. And he's gonna lose yardage here back to the 12-yard line. Third and long, what will Dalton dial up? And he is gonna be taken down. MVP candidates, right? right? The best teams we've seen so far this year. The best games that we've called thus far. How we anticipate the season unfolding. We can go in so many different directions. Because <laughs> the game, certainly not taking us there. Oh, I hear the remotes clicking off right now. They go with Washington to begin the drive. And yeah, nothing doing. Car to throw on second down. They're holding it in, Nelson. And he's going to be taken down here with a penalty flag on the field. Illegal block in the back. Offense. Four down, four down. Check. Four down. We're on second down, Washington. And he'll push his way up to about the 44 here. On third down, Carr. And he'll find Washington. That's complete. And they'll get him down as he's inside the 40. Let's get down, get down. They'll run it now, out of the gun. And he'll be brought down just outside of the 30. Monday, 
They'll run it now out of the gun. And he'll be a little shy of the 25 here. On first down, Hill. And they are able to stop him, but he does take it all the way to the two. They'll try to pound it in with Hill. And he is in. Touchdown, Raiders. You think of the Giants a couple of times. Steelers have done it. You're right. It has happened and will happen more in the future, I'm sure. Here's Dalton. That is incomplete. Passing again. Dalton on second and ten. He drops it off for Bernard. They'll wind up getting ten back. Dalton here from the gun. And that is incomplete. And that's one of the great questions in the NFL, Brandon, because I'm just going to tell you, in the 2015 season, I commentated on three games in a row that were blowouts. And in none of them did the starting quarterback ever come out of the game for the team that had a big lead. And in each instance, I asked the coaches later on, why didn't you do that? And they all looked at me and said, just don't really do that in the NFL. We, we, you know, these guys play, and we just play them all the way through. Now, in certain situations, they, they will take them out, but for the most part... Hey, four down, four down. Down! Wide 80! Where's it on? Here we go. Running game working. They'll stick with it on first down. And he'll take this up only to about his 18-yard line. This is Rashard. And not a whole lot to speak of there as they'll bring him down shy of the 20. Hey, 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 get down, get down. Play action. Now it's Carr. He may try and run for this. And he will avoid the contact. They'll run it now out of the gun. Found a little room there. Again, it's Rashard. And he'll get this up to about the 38-yard line. They'll run it now out of the gun. And he will have first down yardage as he's brought down. Carrying the ball has been key, but those guys up front, they've made a lot of space. For the storyline of this one, Charles, no doubt the number zero. Zilch, nada. A shutout so hard to do in the NFL. It really is. And what an accomplishment because you feel that not just on the defensive side, but as a full team, there's a lot of pride that goes into shutting out an opponent. And how about that zero on the scoreboard for them going along with those zeros in the time column too. So for Oakland, they move ever closer to the perfect regular season as they run things to 14-0. And, and they'll be back home next week to take on the Denver Broncos. Meanwhile, for Cincinnati, they've plummeted now to 3-11. And, and they'll try to get back on the beam next week as they'll head to Cleveland 